Hey, welcome back, Pakistan, to your Caribou Data Science channel. Today is Sunday, uh, September the 5th, 2021. It's time for your daily COVID-19 analysis. Today, because it's Sunday, we'll also take a look at your vaccine rollout numbers, okay, for the week. And as always, of course, you know, don't forget to click on that subscribe button, click on that like button, and finally click on the share button. Share this video on Facebook and Twitter. You can also share it on Insta on the emails and text messages. Thanks so much for your time. Pakistan, let's get on with the show. Let's begin as we always do on Sunday with the vaccine rollout program. Okay. You can see currently uh, Pakistan has administered 59.3 million doses. And of these doses, uh, that's of uh, September the 2nd, 45.4 million people have received a single dose. And as of September 2nd, 18.5 million have been fully vaccinated. So that gives us a number of uh, 20, roughly 20% 20 of people have been vaccinated once. And 8.2% 8, 8 have been fully vaccinated. So let's jump back over here now. Let's take a look at our uh, daily COVID-19 numbers. Because it's Sunday, this actually includes all the numbers for last week, because the weekend's on Saturday, okay? Okay, you can see that... Uh, I'll be right back in a moment. Okay, I'm back. Okay, so let's, let's now take a look at Pakistan's battle with uh, COVID-19. You can see currently you have 7 .9, 7, 11.9, 11.7, uh, 11.8 million uh, cases, 26,000 in death. You can see your pattern has not fallen the rest of the world. You have a series of smaller waves. Uh, right now you can see that... Uh, 
by now you can see that uh, on August the 4th, you had 7,727 cases. For the seven-day period ending August the 31st, you were averaging 4,390 cases per day. You can see here again that your deaths are also increasing. Uh, so this isn't particularly good. Uh, you really need to get more aggressive with your uh, vaccine program, I think, in order to get the deaths down. But as you can see, on, on September the 4th, you had 140 deaths. For the seven-day period ending August the 31st, you were averaging 91 deaths per day. So this 91, this 91 deaths is probably a better number because of the volatility. But also, weekly numbers are also very good. You can see that your cases are definitely a very large, uh, should we call it a wave, maybe? A wave, you've seen a uh, one, two, three, is this the fourth wave for cases? What about deaths? Well, deaths are also seeing one, two, three, four, four waves, four major spikes in deaths for, for Pakistan, unfortunately. And as far as monthly cases, you can see August was the third most cases so far for any month. Deaths was the fourth most, August deaths were the fourth most deaths for any month so far also. So the situation still isn't real good in uh, in Pakistan. I mean, you really, you, you, I'm not sure what you're doing, or, but you really need to start taking uh, this disease more seriously. Really, you know, really get more aggressive with your with your vaccination program. If you have to, uh, whatever you have to do to get these numbers down again, okay? So anyway, Pakistan, that does conclude your report for the day. We'll catch you in a couple of days with an update.